So I am a student and I have some work to do, but I really are ha I'm having a hard time with my keyboarding. And so I'd like to voice type. Very simple to do on a Chromebook. First of all, you want to make sure you have it accessible. So you go to the main menu here. Notice I have mine already up and, and available. And I'm going to show you how to get that because this is really what you want. You want to have it available for you so you can click it right on easily and have it available for you right in the, in the bottom menu. So um, I definitely want to have that menu up. What about how do I get it? I go to the gear here. And you can just search accessibility or go to advanced and go all the way to the bottom to accessibility, right? A lot of times I just search for it. But if I get to accessibility, here's where you can see the option to show it in the system menu, which is what you want. So you want to make sure you toggle that on. You can also go into manage features and you can go through all of them and turn them on or whatever and, and see a complete list. But what I like to do is just make sure that is toggled on here. If it's not, it won't appear in the system menu. So once I've toggled it on, I've got it here. And then I can just go through and I can decide what I want. And in this case, I want dictation to be on. So I'm going to put it on. It's going to appear right here. And now any text box that I have, um, I can dictate to. So for instance, I'm in classroom. I want to respond to the teacher. I click in the comments. I click on the dictation. I really like this lesson. It's pretty cool, period. There you go. Now, always, obviously, read your dictation to make sure it's what you wanted, right? And then you can submit. Any text box works. I'm taking a Google Forms quiz. Here I am taking a quiz. I get to the bottom. I want to dictate my answer. I click in the box again. Slides. I look at it, I go, yep, Google Slides is used to create slideshows. Perfect. And then I go on. Uh, the other thing to remember that if you're working in Google Docs, it already has tools voice typing. So you can use voice typing right in Google Docs and then copy and paste it into anything as well. But this dictation is pretty sweet, right? And the voice typing in here is the same thing. You click to speak. This is voice typing, period. I li love it. You get the idea. So dictation works really well. Uh, use it um, if you need to. Uh, if you need to write longer uh, pieces of writing and it just makes sense to do a voice typing and then reread and revise, that would be great. All right. Have a great day.